Call of Duty, a series loved by millions, but also hated by many. In this situation, buying a game from the series is like being in the middle of a tug of war, and your decision is going to change your gaming life forever. Buying Call of Duty Black Ops changed me as a gamer as well as a person. Welcome to today's episode of Dutch D Memories featuring Call of Duty Black Ops. So, as a PS2 gamer, I was mainly an offline gamer. I never ever had any online experience except Halo 1 on my PC. Now, way back in 2008 and 2009, I didn't have any internet connection for my PS3 so when my dad bought Modern Warfare 2 because it was really hyped in, in 2009 it was said to be one of the best games uh, I refused it and the reason I refused Modern Warfare 2 was because I thought that Modern Warfare 2 is online oriented game with lots of online trophies and there's nothing for a single player gamer like me but I was wrong then everything changed I got a high-speed broadband connection for my PlayStation 3 so I was officially on the PlayStation Network then I started playing some online games such as Killzone 2, Uncharted 2 and then Resistance 2 now Resistance 2 has a lot of history so I, I gotta make another episode for this game too so I met Jacob a really nice person on this game and he, he told me that Black Ops is also a very nice game but since Resistance 2 servers were still running and everyone was enjoying it I didn't bother with any, any Call of Duty game then Resistance 2 servers were kind of messed up there was lag in matchmaking and everything and I, I have spent hundreds of hours on this game by the way and it was really sad for me and I was running out of games to play online and then Jacob and many of my friends were playing Call of Duty Black Ops. They were playing zombies, they were playing multiplayer, and I was kind of feeling left out. So I was thinking a lot about Call of Duty, how it is to play Call of Duty, and what it is like Call of Duty Black Ops zombies. So after a lot of thinking, uh, I decided to you know, try Black Ops demo. I, I found the demo to be quite awesome, to be honest. And then at the same time, the Battlefield 3 was out, and people were enjoying it. I played Battlefield 3 better. I really enjoyed it myself. But the thing is, my old PS3 had some problems. My old PS3's hard disk drive was almost full, and I had only 2 GB left. So Battlefield 3 had 10 GB install texture pack and 1 GB patch and not to mention the DLCs and my internet being slow I couldn't download anything without my internet going down so uh, despite all this awesomeness that Battlefield series has I had to buy Black Ops because more people from my friends list played Black Ops played Black Ops Zombies also, Zombies was one of the contributing factors that led me to buy Black Ops. My dad was really surprised when I said that, Hey dad, I, I really want to play Black Ops, so would you kindly buy it from me? He was like, Hey Darsh, uh, I told you that Call of Duty series is good. Why didn't you get Marvel Warfare 2 when I told you so? Then I was kind of regretting my decision. So, then I got Black Ops. Because of Black Ops, I found many new friends such as James, Evan, Reese, Brock, Atwell. And by the way, Atwell is the guy who told me to do a Dutch D Memories episode on this, this awesome game. So yeah, check out his channel, Twitter and Facebook page. And then, I was really enjoying the game. Uh, the, the loadout system was awesome, the story was awesome, it was based on the Cold War era between the USA and the Soviet Union uh, in the period of the President John F. Kennedy and then I was enjoying zombies with many of my friends uh, Jacob, Agent Mo, Jerry, Mark, Wally, Sean and multiplayer with Blank Train, Aaron 
and many 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 people so from an offline gamer I became an online gamer a Call of Duty gamer and it was a big transition for me as a gamer as well as a youtuber Call of Duty Black Ops uh, gave me more friends and Call of Duty Black Ops improved me as a friend as a person and as a YouTuber, I, I started making more videos on Black Ops, uh, doing better and better commentary. I decided to get a new mic, and I just uh, had this mic on my PS3, and I started using it for my online commentary. So it was a big, big, huge step for me as a YouTuber and as a friend. So in conclusion, I think Black Ops has been a unique experience for me. And like my friend Mark said, everyone has opinion and you should make your own opinion. And I think my opinion is I really like Black Ops. Sometimes you have to listen to your heart instead of looking at graphics. And my message to you today is that whatever game you play, play a game that you really enjoy. And even better if you play that game with your friends. That's going to double your enjoyment. Thank you so much for watching today's episode. For more episodes like this, please visit my channel and subscribe. And thank you Atwo for the idea. Check out his channel and all of my friends' channel. If you have any more ideas, if you have any more suggestions regarding this series, this video, please let me know in the comments section below. For now, Dirty signing off. Have a nice weekend.